Another one. Can I help to build it? One day, Nicholas, I promise. In the meantime, perhaps you could help the elves sort out all the defective toys we received this morning. Okay. This teddy bear is perfect. For Mr. and Mrs. Rose here, yeah? for Nicholas. Oh, wow, he's a Nicholas too. Wow. <laughs> you mean a couple wants to adopt you? Well, according to my friend Michael, the adoption agency forgot to take me off their register, and Mr. and Mrs. Rosier yeah, have an appointment with the director of the orphanage today. You're not going to leave us now, are you? No, but when I was still at the orphanage, I used to dream about having a real mum and dad, a real family. So it's strange to see my wish come true today. So what are you going to do? Nothing I can do. The director will introduce the Rosiers to the other children. That's why they weren't told I'd already left the orphanage. Anyway, I've already got a family. Yeah, Dad's Santa and Mum's Miss Lovejoy. Oh. <laughs> Even if she's not his wife, and with the reindeer and the elves, you've got lots of brothers and sisters. Miss Lovejoy? Humphrey's cold has got much worse, and at least 20 other elves are sick. I've been dishing out my anti-flu herbal tea non-stop, but they're not getting any better. Nicholas, would you mind getting your after-school snack all by yourself? Mom! Dad! Let me introduce my brother. What's up, son? Mommy! Tim Tim's right. Santa, Miss Lovejoy and the elves, they're nice to me, I know. But they're not my real family. A real mum, a real dad. Waldorf, wake up! Waldorf! Huh? I want to go to Australia, to the orphanage. Well... Gee whiz, I'm not feeling so good. Don't worry, Waldorf. I haven't decided to leave, OK? I just want to see Mr and Mrs Rosier. Anyway, I probably won't even like them. I just want to know. Please? Oh, boy. Due to arrive any minute. Hey, thanks, Waldorf. Thanks, Manx. 
I was probably better off just saying no. Whatever happens, you'll always be my friend. Nicholas, you're here at last. See? They look really nice, don't they? If you wouldn't mind following me to my office. Nicholas, they're great. And their dog's so funny. Come on, what are you hiding yourself away for? Michael, wait. I'm not sure I want to be adopted. Say what? Hey, if I were you, I wouldn't hesitate a single second. Maybe you're right, but you didn't leave the orphanage to become the new Santa. I just came to see if Mr and Mrs Rosier were really nice people before I decide. Hey, they say that you can tell what someone is really like if you take them by surprise. Why don't we try putting that little idea to the test? Michael? Hello, Michael. Hello, sir. What's your dog's name? Does he have fleas? Does he bite? Do you like banana bread? Have you ever seen a flying saucer? Do you know karate? <laughs> Michael! <laughs> will you please stop that at once? I don't understand it. He's normally rather a shy boy. <laughs> In any case, he puts on quite a show. <laughs> <laughs> I've got another idea. Come on. Work. Make up. Lost time. Make up. Lost time. I'm afraid there's been a mistake. I'm truly sorry, but Nicholas's file should never have been with that agency. Donut, that's enough. Don't tell me another couple has already adopted Nicholas. No. As a matter of fact, Nicholas no longer lives at this orphanage. He left. But we've prepared his room. Look here, I've brought pictures. Our house, the garden and the pool, and the pony. A dream come true. Donut! Why don't we let him have a run around? Shall I show you around the orphanage? of Santa and it makes me sad. You'd better hurry up, Nicholas, or else they might adopt another child. I know. They are nice, Waldorf. They have a dog and a pony. Oh, sure, a pony. That's nothing. I bet it doesn't even fly. They say some of them even bite. <laughs> Destroyed the 
machine! You destroyed your own invention just to save me? Nicholas, you're more important to me than all the inventions in the whole world. Somehow it's as if you are our very own little boy. Look, pictures! Yeah, those are some old photos. People who wanted to adopt me a long time ago. Mr. and Mrs. Rosier, but I didn't want to go. What? But why not? Urgent mail for Nicholas! <laughs> it's my friend Michael. Mr. and Mrs. Rosier want to adopt him, and Michael has written to me asking if he's doing the right thing by saying no. Mr. and Mrs. Rosier, eh? The exact same people who wanted to adopt you a long, long time ago? What a coincidence! And what is your advice? To say yes right away. Michael is going to have a real family. And what about you? Wouldn't you like to have a real family? I have one. A real family isn't just a real mom and a real dad. It's when you <laughs> love each other.